Good morning, everybody. I've got some exciting news. Today, we're coming to you from the war room. This is where it all happens. This is my personal office, and so welcome here. So what are we going to talk about today? And first of all, let me say, everything that we talk about today, follow on my blog post. We've got a link right there below that we're putting there for you. So you can click on that, read it, print it, uh, keep it for your records. So we're going to talk about home inspections. It's such an important part of the real estate transaction. And so you're going to get under contract after you negotiate the price and with my contracts that I use, you're going to have 10 business days to get a home inspection. So very important to get this home inspection. Uh, always get a home inspection. Very important. And so we're going to talk about why you want to do that today. And let me take a moment to say everything that I say here is going to be in the blog. It's going to be in the blog. So pay attention to that link there. Print it off. Keep it. So the first reason that you want to get a home inspection is because it's going to uncover the hidden defects or problems with the property. Now, I'm not saying that they're hidden because somebody's being shady, but a lot of times we live in our homes and we are oblivious to some of these issues that seem to occur. And, you know, they're, you're going to say, well, wait a minute, did they not give me a property disclosure on the front end that I had to look at and I had three days to, to look over that. Uh, yes, they may have, but you know what it says in that property disclosure? It says that your seller, the one that you're buying the house from, is probably not a licensed roofer, probably not a licensed plumber, probably not a licensed electrician. So they don't have a lot of knowledge about these areas. They just don't see any problems with them. So what you want to do is you want to get this home inspector in there to look at the property and to give you a general idea of what might need some maintenance. Maybe it needs maintenance now. Maybe you're like, oh my gosh, don't, don't buy this because the HVAC's about to explode. Probably not. But what if it did? But what they're probably going to say is, you know, look, this is not a brand new HVAC. But in a few years, it's probably going to need some help. So you need to consider that into your home purchase because you may have to buy an HVAC in the future. Take another moment here. Segue. Um, guys, you might end up looking at like some home warranties, a lot of different companies. If the report comes back and they're like, everything's good and in working order, a home warranty is a good way to satisfy those future needs. Uh, so... Always ask your agent if there are some home warranty options there. Um, why else? What about negotiating power? So like you get this house and you're so excited about it. It's a beautiful home. But then you find out, let's just go back to the HVAC. Sorry, HVAC guys, you're going to be busy after this blog post, I know. And uh, everybody reads this. It could be a HVAC. It could be a dishwasher. It could be a roof. It could be any mechanical thing with the house. But let's say that you find out that there are some issues. You get to go back to the drawing table and say, wait a minute. You know, I'm going to have a lot of closing costs to pay here. And so instead of you guys basically taking care of all these needs, I can take care of them in the future if I have more money in my pocket now. So why don't you guys pay my closing cost? Or, you know, there are all sorts of negotiations that you can do because you're finding out about this home and you are giving yourself some wiggle room with uh, future negotiations in the process. And then lastly, and this is the one that is so important because we all like to get a good night's rest. It gives you peace of mind. It lets you know, I know about this home. And so... Again, this is one of the most important parts of the process because it can give you peace of mind now, or if you don't get it, you can get a lot of heartache and heartburn later. So, folks, look at uh, these home inspections. Whenever you get in there, um, they're going to go over your plumbing, HVAC, appliance, safety concerns. They're so important. Any realtor that is reputable is going to have a list of home inspectors with at least a few of them that they will say personally these are the ones you know that I like and always look for like two or three they should give you like two or three and, and, you, and you want to look at the price prices are different availability is different and then personality 
a lot of different personalities in home inspectors. Um, and so make sure you measure that out too. Uh, and make sure that it's somebody that will fit with you. You might actually see if you can see a sample report, see if you like the readability of the report. Some of those are different. Um, but again, very important, get a home inspection, work with a real estate professional because we've done this before. And if you have any questions, you can always call me 501-764-6847. Again, that's 501-764-6847. And I look forward to seeing you next time.